Welcome to a whole new world. The digital classroom of Maryland Academy. A smart class like never before. Easy learning. Happy learning. Happy children. Happy families. Being tidy. Keep clean. Once imbibed, tidiness becomes a natural feature and does not change. If being tidy is the rule for children, it must be the rule for adults as well. When do you like yourself, when you're clean or when you're messy? Why should you be tidy? What will happen if you don't put away your things properly? Do you think everyone has to help in order to keep parks and roads clean? Whose job is it to keep the house clean? Tidiness means keeping everything in its place. There are two books, one is clean and the other is dirty. Which book will you choose? How would you feel if your teacher showed your notebook to everyone because it was neat and tidy? How would you feel if your teacher showed your notebook to everyone because it was dirty and untidy? How would you feel if your friends refused to share their books with you because you don't take care of them? Imagine that you've just tidied up your desk and someone comes and dirties it. How would you feel? What must you do to keep your notebooks tidy? How do you feel when you go to a park and find it dirty? Have you ever thrown empty chips, packets or chocolate wrappers on the road? Do you think you were right in doing so? Answer in yes or no. Check how many clean habits you have. I throw waste paper in dustbins. I sharpen my pencils over the waste paper basket. I throw garbage on the road. I put my dirty clothes into the laundry basket. If I take out something, I remember to put it back in its place. I don't spit on the road. At times, I scribble on the walls. I keep my bag and shoes in their proper places. Imagine. You go to a park for a picnic. There are bits of paper thrown around the swings. The park has no dustbins. What will you do? The dustbin in your room is full. You need to sharpen your pencil. What will you do? You are playing with your friend in school. She says, come, let us scribble on the wall. What will you do? Do you or don't you? Let's put a star. I sharpen my pencils over the waste basket. I do not write on or scratch the school desk. I put my clothes in the wash. I help my parents keep the house clean. I put things back in their places. How many stars did you get? If you got four or more stars, you're very clean and tidy. If you got three stars or less, you need to try harder. Remember, keep clean. Cleanliness is next to godliness. Make things happen. Take inspired action. Learn from yesterday, live for today, hope for tomorrow.